The iconic Honda Civic epitomizes compact car excellence with its mix of practicality and a fun-to-drive personality. The versatile Honda has a version for everyone, its lineup includes a two-door coupe as well as a four-door sedan and hatchback. It's available with two excellent four-cylinder engines and either an adroit continuously variable automatic transmission CVT, or a slick shifting six-speed manual. We appreciate its comfy ride and fuel efficiency, but the Civic's optional touchscreen infotainment system is plagued with usability issues. While that's proof that the affable Honda isn't perfect, it excels everywhere else and ranks near the top of its class. What's new for 2018? After several significant additions to the 2017 model lineup, the 10th generation Civic enters 2018 without a single update. What was new for 2017? This year saw the addition of a 6-speed manual transmission to turbocharged Civic XT coupes and sedans. It also marked the return of the Civic hatchback. Unlike the sedan and the coupe, the hatchback is only available with Honda's turbocharged 1.5-liter 4-cylinder. Plus, the hatchback exclusive sport and sport touring trims brought 180 horses to the stable, six more than in other Civic models fitted with this engine. Additionally, the Civic X sedan became standard with satellite radio, for a trial period. Trims and options we choose. Buyers seeking practicality don't need a crossover, nor do those seeking sportiness need to buy a sports car. The Honda Civic Sport hatchback does both at an affordable price, starting at $22,375. The Sport model has a standard 180 horsepower turbo inline 4 that's slightly more powerful than the same engine in other Civic trims. It pairs with a standard 6-speed manual transmission that saves $800 versus the optional CVT. The Sport hatchback also includes Leather-wrapped steering wheel and shift knob Automatic climate control 18-inch wheels Unfortunately, the Sport trim cannot be equipped with the Honda Sensing package, which includes active safety stalwarts such as adaptive cruise control and forward collision warning. Those interested in such features will have to choose a model with the CVT, not the manual transmission. The Honda Sensing package also costs an extra $1,000 except on upper-level touring and sport touring trims, on which it's standard. Babylon's came